Hello and welcome back to WeBC. Now, Discord is one of the greatest voiceover internet protocol apps to grace our PCs over the last decade, and it doesn't like it will be replaced anytime soon. In this video, we are going to show you how to use Discord text formatting and bring some zest into your Discord servers. So jumping straight in, we'll first start off with bold text. So to do bold text, what you're going to do is insert two asterisks, followed by your text, followed by another two asterisks, and there you will have bold text. To do italic text, you just insert one asterisk, followed by your text, followed by another asterisk. You can also do this by doing one underscroll, followed by your text, followed by another underscroll, and that will do the same italic effect. Bold italics, take it up a step now, you will do three asterisks, followed by your text, followed by three asterisks. So that is bold italic and bold italic. To do underscroll text, what you're gonna do is do two underscrolls, followed by your text, followed by two underscrolls, and you will have underlined text. And to do strike through text, you're gonna insert two tildes, like so, followed by your text, followed by two tildes again, and there you have it. Now, what we can do is do a combination of these effects. So say you want bold italic and underscroll, what you will do is three asterisks, three under two underscrolls, uh, your text, two underscrolls again, and three asterisks, and there you will have bold italic underscroll. And you can do this with all of them. So you could do bold italic underscroll strike through if you want, and to do that, you'll have to pretty much insert all of them. So you'll do, you'll do three asterisks, two underscrolls, two tildes, your text, two tildes, two underscroll, and three asterisks, and you will have a conjoined message of bold italic underscroll and strike through. And those are the basics of formatting. So before we go on to doing colored text, we'll show you how to do a code block. Now this is technically classed as advanced Discord text formatting, but it's really quite simple. Simply, all you have to do is use the backtick key enter your text and another backtick key and it will display in this cool little gray box. Now let's move over to colored text. And when it comes to colored Discord text, we are actually using a workaround with syntax highlighting and that basically means by typing the name of a syntax language, you will get colored text. Now that sounds quite complicated and it is somewhat more advanced than the previous things that we've shown, but it's not too difficult. So to do red text, what we're gonna do is do three backticks followed by the word diff and then move on to the next line. Do a dash, followed by your text. Go to the next line, followed by another three backticks, and you will have red text. So you can do this with other colors. So for orange text, we're gonna do three backticks, followed by the word CSS. Move to the next line and create a box and put your text in that box. Finish it up once again with three backticks and you will have orange text. To do yellow text, once again, three backticks. The word fix, go on to the next line and write your text. And as you guessed, three more back ticks. And there's your yellow text. For light green, once again, three back ticks, followed by the word diff again. This time we are gonna use a plus, followed by our text, and followed by three back ticks again. For cyan, once again, three back ticks, followed by JSON, followed by a speech mark with your text in there. Close it with a speech mark, go to the next sentence and close it once again with three back ticks and you'll have cyan. And finally to use blue, we're gonna use three back ticks again, the letters I and I, create a box again and put your text in there, go to the next line and three more back ticks and there is blue. So here we have a selection of colors. Now let's get into how to highlight this text with color. Now to highlight text with color, you need to follow the steps as previously mentioned, but add a dollar sign at the start. So for example, we're gonna use three back ticks, text, move to the new line, insert a dollar sign, do our text, go to the next line once again and close it with three back ticks and we have our highlighted text. So guys, they are the basics of text discord formatting. If you found this useful, we would love you to leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell and we'll see you in the next one.